Hello, most amazing artists. We are going to be learning how to make these summer Olafs today because do you know what time it is? It's summertime, I know, so exciting. It's time to kick back and relax and we're gonna do some drawing right now. And these are the materials you will need. So you will need a piece of paper, something to draw with like a pencil and you know, something to color with. So let's go ahead and get started with this drawing. So the first thing we're going to do, we're gonna start with the eyes of our Olaf. So we're gonna draw two big circles right next to each other. After we do that, we're gonna add uh, two smaller circles inside. So one there, one there, bada bing, bada boom, and there we go. We're gonna just color in the smaller circles for now. So now that we have colored inside the eyes, now we're going to work on the carrot nose. So we're going to draw kind of like a curved vertical line um, underneath the eyes in the middle. Now what I'm doing here is marking my paper. I used my pencil to find the middle uh, across and put a little dot on the side and playing connect the dots here to create that uh, sideways triangle. So that could help you to create your sideways triangle for the nose. Now I'm adding little lines to create that carrot texture. Okay, so we got the eyes, we got the nose. Now we're gonna start working on his eyebrows because he's a very happy snowman because he loves summer, right? So we're gonna add those happy eyebrows going above the eyes, kind of slightly diagonal curved eyebrows. So that's that. Now we're gonna work on his big old smile. So we're going to come to the left eye and draw his cheek. We're drawing kind of a curved line coming out from that eye. Okay, we got that. Now we're gonna add a line underneath that. This is the beginning of, of his smile. And so we're gonna draw that slightly diagonal line and draw a curved line like a, a wide U coming around above the carrot nose. All right, now we're gonna draw the other side of his face. So we're gonna come to the um, right eye and draw a line coming out and bring it into the smile. Okay, so we got most of the head done. Now we're going to draw the top of his head by drawing a curved line, kind of like a rainbow shape around his face. And remember at any time that you need to pause or rewind the video because it's going a little too fast, you can do that. Okay, now we're going to work on his little stick hair sticking out from the top of his head. So I'm just adding a couple of lines to create um, his little hair coming out of his head. So once I've got his hair with those little li or stick lines, now we're going to work on his big enormous a smile because he is just such a happy snowman so now what we're going to do is draw a big u coming around so i started from the left side and worked over to the right now he's got a big old tooth in his mouth right so we're gonna draw two lines and connect it with a horizontal line and i'm just gonna lightly shade in side his mouth so i know that i'll color that in darker all right, so now I'm gonna finish off the rest of his face by drawing a line from the uh, left side and then going over to the right side, a line that kind of slightly comes in to create his long um, face. And then I'll connect those together with another slightly curved line. You did it, now we've done the face, the hard stuff, now we're gonna work on the rest. We're gonna do the body. So we're gonna add a curved line for uh, one ball of snow and then we're gonna add another curve line around town kind of like a big U shape and then I'll add in his rock buttons um, I think he has one on top and two at the bottom and the, that's it and now we're gonna work on the, um, the his feet so we're gonna add again kind of two um, U shape curved lines for his feet wonderful Okay, now we're just gonna add in the stick arms. So I'm just adding diagonal line and then adding his little stick hands and fingers and all that good stuff. And I'll do that to the other side as well. Nice work, you did it. You made a super duper awesome Olaf. He looks great. 
So what I'm gonna do now is add in a background. So where's your Olaf gonna be? Mine right here is gonna be enjoying surfing on a surfboard. So what I'm doing here is drawing two curved lines that come out. Um, so it looks like the surfboard is behind him. So I'm not gonna draw a curved line going through, just two lines that come out. And now I'm gonna connect those lines with a big curve U line to make my surfboard. And now I'm going to add any other details to make my background like sun and a cloud, clouds and uh, I might add a big old wave that he is surfing on. So uh, maybe you want your Olaf tanning on the beach or I don't know, whatever you wanna do um, to make your, your background, you can add those details. Um, now once I finish drawing everything, I like to go over and trace everything with a uh, black marker to outline my drawing that was in pencil to really make it pop. So when I color it in, my drawing really, um, really pops and, and I can see it very well. So you can do that. Um, you can also, which you'll see in a little bit, I'm gonna add some sunglasses to my Olaf if you wanna do that too. Uh, what I did, it was just draw a line that goes across and then add two little boxes underneath and add two lines coming out diagonally to make some sunglasses for my Olaf. And ta-da, that is it. Look at that, it looks so awesome. You can color in your Olaf however you would like, but I hope you had a super fun time making our favorite snowman who loves the summer. And I hope you have a super duper summer as well.